Hi and welcome to Add More Zest with Diamonds. My name's Rebecca and I've got some goodies to share with you today from Diamond Art Gift. Uh, it's a couple of off the canvas items. Um, one item, I've unboxed something similar before but this was different and a couple of items that seem to be new. So I'm going to start with the one that I've unboxed similar before. Uh, it's fairly new in relation to, while I have unboxed a couple, they've been more recent. But these caught my eye because they were different again. Uh, so these are coasters, which I say I have unboxed coasters before. But these were different slightly because, firstly, these are on wood whereas others tend to be on acrylic but these actually make up a picture so this is where it's going to be fun so I'm guessing we definitely have blue around the same place is it that way see that matches but that doesn't so maybe that comes the other side maybe maybe not but they do sort of make up, I say, together an image. I just can't remember off the top of my head how that image goes. Oh, that matches up to there. So that's good. The numbers are actually the right way round according to what they are. There we go. There's that one. And there's that one. So there we go. I managed to make the image. Um, so yeah, I thought they were a little bit different because they make a whole image out of, of course, the two, four, six, seven different coasters. A little bit of a fun way to have them on the table if you use them as coasters, of course. Uh, plus, these ones are funky and bright colours. So we do have some black, which of course is the shadow outlines, but then look at these ones. We have gorgeous pinks, yellows, orangey, peachy colours, some blues, some more pinks, more peaches, some purple, and a little bit more peach at the end. So I thought they were really nice ones. These are standard diamonds, they're not rhinestones. So they are your standard diamond colours. They don't come with DMC numbers though. So just so you know, they don't have DMC numbers on them. But the numbers, there is 18 different numbers on here and you do each number on, of course, each individual coaster. But yeah, they're on a really nice dark wood and then you do have a clear coating over the top to of course protect the glue until you have made up your image so yeah that's a little bit different spin on something that we have or i have unboxed of before so that's number one number two is again i suppose another one i have unboxed a bookmark before but this is a different type of bookmark rather than this being a strip this is one that you put over the corner of your page so you would slip this onto the corner of your book you could use it to decorate the front of a book if you wanted to, front of a notebook or something like that. And you actually diamond paint on this um, a thin acrylic top piece. And then of course you can see the black the way through and it has been stitched. You do get a toolkit. This one is rhinestones. Um, and there are different shapes on this one as well. So we have, this is the end. So these are the standard rhinestones. We have yellow, clear, blue, red. Then we have some white pearls. Uh, we have some gorgeous orange ones. These will make up the rim around here. We have some teardrop ones that are placed in here. As you can see, you only need four. Uh, you get seven. And then we have some tiny little sort of teardrop 
petal shaped ones. Where do the tiny ones go? This is where I can't see for locking. Oh, there we go. So some of the tiny petal ones go here, either side of the bigger one. And then some of the others look to go here. Is that number two? Yeah, it is number two. So some of the others go on here. So I can see four of them. I think we have a few more than four in there. So definitely a plenty of diamonds to be able to complete your little mini corner coverer. Maybe it's called that instead of a bookmark. So of course you can use it to mark your book. So that's number two. And then number three, they have started doing some tumblers that you can diamond paint. I went for a bright funky one because I love diamond painting in funky colours. Oh, it's got ABs as well. So you get this as an acrylic sheet. Looks like something's got caught under the plastic there. Uh, but once you've peeled that back, that will be able to come off. So this is your printed design. And I say, I chose a bright sort of scalloped one. And then once you are done, you pop this in your tumbler. So you can take it out to wash it. Trying to get it overlapped that little bit at the bottom where there or on the sides where there is a bit that you don't actually diamond paint. And then once you pop it in, imagine that with some pretty diamonds on it. That is a pretty funky cup. Um, and that comes apart, of course. So you've got your cup section. It does come with a toolkit and the number one, which is actually all the scales, is an AB, which is rather nice. I didn't realise it was an AB. It's a 16 ounce cup, just so you know. But lots of white AB there for your scallops. And then here we go. We've just got funky colours. Purple, pink, turquoise, yellow, pale yellow, a darker pink and a more, a lighter purple so yeah another fun thing that you could do just to have diamond painting in more places than on your wall because why not why not is what i say uh, so i will pop links to each of these down below there are different designs in each of them so there are different tumbler cups with different designs on there are the corner bookmarks and there are posters that make up an image there is a few different images these are just the ones that caught my eye or i thought that they would be fun to do or somebody i know to be able to do um, i have somebody in mind for this one so yeah i will pop links to each of them down below but feel free to have a good browse and a search around the site so that you can see what the other designs are in case one of those catches your eye a little bit more but thank you so much um of course to diamond art gift for sending me these and thank you to you guys as always for watching i'll speak to you all again soon <laughs>